The New York Times reports, in fact, that Trump is trying to instill doubt that the debate will be fair, implying if he does badly, it's not his fault. A Harris campaign spokesman was asked if they were trying to lower expectations when it comes to the rules. He said no. So what are the expectations and does Harris have unfairly high ones placed on her as compared to the overall lower expectations for Trump? She absolutely has higher expectations placed on her. And that's not just because she can string together a sentence without meandering five times and telling four <laughs> different lies. There are additional expectations on her for quite a few reasons. Oh, boy, here we go. But we also have to recognize that as a woman at that podium, as a South Asian woman at that podium, and certainly as a black woman at that podium, You ain't black. She's got a particular line that some people are expecting her to toe, that they want her to show up as lawyerly and prosecutorial, but she also has to uh, appease certain people by not crossing into uh, the, the category of angry black woman. Well, that's an impossible task to do because no matter how clearly or eloquently she expresses herself, some people are going to think that anyway. We hmm. know that there are additional uh, uh, expectations placed on her because of race and class. One of the things that Kamala Harris is going to have to rise above, and one thing that every black woman in this country, unfortunately, has to rise above, is the angry black woman trope. And it will be difficult considering the fact that Donald Trump will use racism. He will use sexism. But these people are crazy. These people are crazy. I think that we're going to see the prosecutor versus the convicted felon. I also think we're going to see him put racism and white supremacy on full display. And Kamala Harris, as a smart woman, as a woman who's been a woman of color her entire life, there isn't anything that man can say on that stage that she has not heard. She's risen to the ranks that she is, but in spite of those things, not because of them. Yep. Br off, turn it off, for God's sake, turn it off. Not yet. And so if it comes to those racist tropes, those sexist tropes, the massage noir that we've continued to see directed at her. And she's going to be someone who is the adult in the room, someone who is able to avoid the, the, the racist tropes that are thrown her way. And one thing that every black woman in this country, unfortunately, has to rise above is the angry black woman trope. Uh, the, the category of angry black woman. I also think we're going to see him put racism and white supremacy on full display. <laughs> what is your answer? C. C. Final answer. Final answer. I think he's getting bored. <laughs> but he's right again for $250,000. The most dangerous terrorist threat to our homeland is white supremacy.